Tally Hoes, welcome back to my YouTube channel or if you're new, hello, my name's Tally Sharp and it would literally mean the world to me if you could hit that subscribe button and become part of my Tally Ho community. So today I have such an exciting video for you guys. I literally can't get the smile off my face. I have five everyday outfit ideas for you, but this is in sponsorship with Boohoo. What? I'm so excited to be working with Boohoo because I always shop from there. They're always on trend, they're so stylish and they are so affordable. Plus, they always have sales and I have actually got you guys a discount code. So I'll leave that on the screen and it will also be in the description bar. Everything that I'm gonna be showing will be linked down in the description bar. So if you do decide to buy anything, please shop through those links. And as for now, let's get into this video. Please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and also subscribe if you haven't already and let go to this Boohoo. I need to calm down. So the first outfit, I got a square neck ribbed, obviously, bodysuit. Let's check the poppers. We like a good popper on this channel. <laughs> that sounds like we like granddads. This bodysuit is super, super stretchy, really, really comfortable. Of course, you can wear it with absolutely anything. It comes in white, it comes in black, which I'll show you later, and it also comes in a camel colour. I got this in a size 22, and it was £12. So, to go with this bodysuit, I got a beautiful, the cutest skirt ever. This was like the first thing that I picked out because it's so cute. It's a button through contrast stitch denim skirt. There isn't much stretch to it. And when I originally opened this, I was like, there's no way that's gonna fit me. But surprisingly, it does. I got it in a size 22. Now you could literally wear this with any outfit. Like I can definitely see myself wearing this with like a nice turtleneck jumper because it's getting colder here in England now, sad times. The length of it is really, really nice. This was 20 pounds, but I've just gone on their website and it's down to six pounds. So if you can still get your hands on this skirt, definitely do it, trust me. Like I said though, it doesn't have any stretch. It does fit really, really nicely on me. I could have sized up, but there's no belt loops. So I am happy with the size that I got. So to go on top of that outfit, I got a beautiful crochet knit cardigan and it's in orange, which I kind of regret getting, to be honest. You guys know that I'm trying to step away from just wearing black, so I wanted to get an orange one to be more colorful and vibrant with my life. <laughs> and I just feel like with an all black outfit or with an outfit like this, it's a staple piece in the outfit. So I do love it, but of course you can't wear it with every single thing. Now it is an oversized cardigan, so I got it in a size 20, also regretting that because it doesn't really look oversized on me at all. And you know, some things can be so oversized that you just sort of look baggy and like not put together. And that wasn't the look I was going for. However, definitely get your true size in this. Of course it still fits me, but it's just kind of the look that you're going for. And I wanted the oversized look, but I was just a little bit nervous about how oversized it was gonna be. But an outfit like this, You've got a beautiful plain bodysuit, then you've got a contrast stitch denim skirt, which is so classy and sexy. Then you've got the beautiful orange crochet knitted cardigan, and it was £22. So with this, obviously, as us plus size women know, we do chafe. So I got some lace chafing pads. These were eight pounds and I got them in a size 22. How, oh. however, these are so big. So definitely size down by at least two sizes, I would say, because this literally just gets on my leg and slides right off. I really wanted to try chafing pads because I've never tried them before. And chafing has to be like one of the worst things ever. It hurts so much. So these would have come in really handy, but definitely in these lace chafing pads, sized down by two sizes. I don't know how the other ones will fit. So to finish off this outfit with some accessories, I got some silver earrings, small hoops so that you can just wear them every single day. It's just an everyday look. You can literally wear these with any outfit. They're just really cute, really simple. They also come in gold and they were four pounds. I don't know if you can tell or not, but they do have a cross detailing in there. And then I got an everyday watch. Now, 
for some reason i don't wear a lot of watches but i really want to start to to sort of like get my life in order so i got this classic metal mesh watch now this is 20 pounds but at the moment it's reduced to 10 squid 10 squid i'm gonna put it on now because i can <laughs> actually i probably shouldn't because i burnt my arm when i was uh curling my hair earlier oh yeah it's irritating my burn but look how beautiful that is <laughs> why am i like this but how cute is that if you guys can get this for £10 in the sale right now, do it. Okay, so don't laugh. To finish off this outfit, I got another pair of boots. In every single haul, I'm getting a pair of boots and it's an obsession, just leave me alone. So these are wide fit, I got them in a size five. They're croc cleated hiker boots. Can you see? They're so, so cute. I'm, I am gonna be honest with you guys, these are quite narrow wide fit. It could be because of the laces, but actually it looks quite narrow here too. I love the fact that there's a zip, because I don't like sliding my foot in every time I put on my boots. Now I did get these boots for quite a few of these outfits, so if you're not a boot fan, then I'm really, really sorry. You can actually pair this outfit with trainers. These were also 35 pounds, love them. I love boots. So this is outfit one altogether. We've got the beautiful wide fit croc cleated hiker boot with a beautiful everyday watch. We've got some small hoop earrings. We've got a white ribbed square neck bodysuit with a contrast stitch skirt and a beautiful oversized crochet knitted jumper. Definitely let me know which one's your favorite at the end in the comments down below. Let's move on to outfit number two. So I got a Guns N' Roses license t-shirt, but it is a dress. It's a beautiful soft material, this. Do I listen to Guns N' Roses? No. I got this in a size 22 and it's so stretchy and comfortable. And it was 22 pounds. I just love the pink in this. Now I will be wearing this as a dress, however, we have got that chafing problem. So to go underneath, I got some long line, extra thick cycling shorts. However, these are definitely not extra thick. These are actually quite thin. Can you see my mirror through it? I got these in a size 22 and they were 10 pounds. They are really good for size. They fit really, really nicely. The length is really good on these, but they're definitely not extra thick. Definitely not. You won't really be seeing this under the skirt anyway, or you can decide to let them be seen below the dress because that's still a different look in itself. I love the material of these cycling shorts because they're kind of like gym pants. So however much you chafe, the fabric doesn't give. So to go on top of this outfit, I got another cardigan and it is another chunky oversized cardigan. This was 20 pounds and I got it in a size 20. This one is definitely gonna be worn like every single day on top of everything, jeans, dresses, everything. Trust me. This one's so cozy and it's definitely more oversized than that orange one because I've still sized down and it's still oversized and that's kind of my thought process you know it has got pockets i probably should have got this in pink because it would kind of match the pink roses but you can wear gray with literally everything as well so to accessorize this outfit i've gone for some trainers these are super chunky trainers i got these in a size five and they do fit really really nicely i tried these on with some fishnet tights now i wouldn't wear that with any socks but i did try it on in the try on clip with fishnet socks but i feel like i was doing too much with this outfit so take away the socks i got these from boohoo as well these were three pounds however i feel like i was doing too much so i wouldn't wear socks that you can see with these shoes because i feel like less is more and personally on me wearing these shoes with socks would just be a little bit too clunky otherwise i actually tried this outfit on with these boots and that was more me. So I'd probably wear this second outfit with these boots as well. But you can literally wear the white trainers with anything. Just a really cute everyday trainer, comfortable. They fit nicely and they do actually come in another color, but I just wanted them to be white and sleek. 
Did I say how much these were? They were £25. So to accessorise, I got a layered necklace. All of Boohoo's accessories are so pretty. They have so many different layered necklaces to choose from. It was so hard to pick. But I decided to go for this one because it's not doing too much and it hasn't got any crosses or anything like that. Because I don't really wear crosses and stuff. I just think, again, less is more. So this layered necklace is just the right amount. On the trial clip, I did tuck this big one in. Oh, I should have worn it with, I should have worn it today. I did tuck it in just because I felt like it was too much with all of the graphics on the front. But this would be so cute even with the first outfit I showed you guys. But then this is gold and the other jewellery was silver. And this necklace was £5. So here is the outfit all together. We've got the Guns N' Roses licensed t-shirt dress. With the long line cycling shorts, we've got the chunky oversized cardigan. And then we've got the chunky sole lace-up trainers with the layered necklace. Let's move on to outfit three. So outfit three is so girly and so cute. We've got a white skater dress. The detailing on this dress is to die for. So cute. Now you can wear this off the shoulder if you want to. Personally, I wouldn't so that I can wear a normal bra with it. Now this dress I got in a size 22 and it's very, very small to size. It was a struggle to get on. So definitely size up in this dress. Because it was so oversized, please don't judge. In the try on clip, my boobs are so squashed. I could have taken my bra off with it. That could work. But yeah, I would definitely size up in this. It was so tight, like it proper pulled me in. And then there was just a whole lot of explosion with the boobs. As for the length of this, love it. It's so cute. You can get it in short sleeved, but I wanted to get it in long sleeve. Just absolutely beautiful. You'll see it better on the try on clip. Has got a few buttons. Oh my God, I've just realized something. This is a size 20. Oh my God, no wonder it was hard to get on. It's got no stretch in it. Ha! Huh? I'm actually quite proud that it actually zips up then. What? So actually I wouldn't size up in this dress because if it actually came in size 22, then it would have been fine. Anyway, let's move on because I'm sure you're bored. So for shoes, I was thinking some beautiful platform sandals. These were 25 pounds and they're wide fit. Now they definitely are wide fit, these ones. They're nice. Now these you can wear with legitly anything. Really nice quality as well. I really like these. For a bag, I got this one. Obviously it's round. It has got like a crocodile print on it. I actually think it's a mixture of snake print and crocodile print. What is the difference? I don't even know. So the way you open it is like this. And then it's elasticated so that it can't fully open or nothing can fall out, which is good. And this was £18. It's kind of like a suitcase. <laughs> and then it just clips right on there. I really like the clip of this. The button. Nice. And then you can wear it like this. Or you can just wear it on one arm. Love this. This could go with any outfit. So then I got some tortoiseshell sunglasses. Hey, these were six pound and as you can see, they're round. I just think they're really cute. I've never had round sunglasses in my life. I wanted to step up my game and here I am. Now these are so wide, like so wide that they could fall off my face, but they don't, which is fantastic. Sometimes I have difficulty actually looking through sunglasses, but this has like a really nice tint to them. I think it's because it's brown and not black. I just keep having epiphanies in this haul, don't I? So as you can see that this is a little bit more of a summery summer outfit, because I did do a poll on my Instagram asking you guys like what you'd want to see, just an everyday outfit or more of a summer everyday outfit. And it was mixed but general outfits did win. So, but I just wanted to add in like one summer one, even though it's totally not like summer in England right now. So 
Okay, so here is the outfit in full. So we've got the sweetheart skater dress with the white platform sandals, the snake print cross body bag, and then we have also got the tortoiseshell contrast frame around sunglasses. Before we actually move on from this outfit, I just wanna say everything so far has been such good quality and has fitted really nicely apart from that dress, but it's a size 20, not 22. So that's that sorted out. Okay, we've got two outfits left. I'm sorry that this is a super long video. So to start off this outfit, I have the most gorgeous thing that you've ever seen in your life. I actually wanted this in white, but they had sold out. It's so gorgeous. Can you see it? So this is the woven tie detail blossom sleeve crop. Can I read? I got this in a size 22, it fits beautifully. It's kind of got like puffy arms and then at the end it's elasticated. Now this is a crop but it's got such good coverage. It does get a little bit baggy at the back which is annoying but as for the coverage of the back it's really really nice. Wearing this with high-waisted jeans, it doesn't show too much skin. So the coverage is really good. Really, really like this. Like, I'm gonna be wearing this with everything. Oh my God, this with like jeans and heels for a night out. That would still be cute. Oh, but then it's still cute for like brunch and then it's cute for like a picnic. I love this so much. This is actually on sale right now for seven pounds. So get your fingers on this one, gals. To go with this, I got some mum jeans. Now, if you've been with me for a while, you know that I just wear skinny jeans because I don't really like the way that mum jeans sit on me. Like, they get really baggy around the pouch area and it kind of just doesn't look right on me. But whenever I see them, and especially on Boohoo, they look so cute. So I wanted to try some. These are ripped all over mum jeans. At the bottom, they're folded up a little bit. I got these in a size 24. I mostly always size up with denim on Boohoo. And that's why the first skirt I thought wasn't gonna fit, but it does fit really nicely. This is really good for size, but of course I still have the problem of the bagginess around the pouch area, which I'm not a fan of. Maybe I just need to get used to it. The back pockets are real. They've got loops for a belt as well. There's no stretch to these jeans, like they're proper denim jeans. I do actually really love this outfit. Like I think that this outfit is really, really cute. Love the quality of these jeans. You'll see for yourself in the trial clip what I mean by the bagginess. I just think I need to get used to it. I also think that maybe a belt would look better with these jeans as well. It's so weird because like most plus size girls, they go for like baggy things and I go for tight things. So this is so something I would never normally wear. But we're all about stepping out of our comfort zone on this channel, guys. So to go with this outfit, I got the cutest little rucksack. Rucksack? Apparently I always say it wrong. So now I'm just really cautious whenever I say it. Ruck, ruck, rucksack, rucksack. This is 16 pounds and it is mini compared to my phone. It's pretty small, but you could fit everything that you need in here to go shopping. It would be so cute because if you get tired, you can just put it on as a rucksack. Or you can just have it over like one shoulder and be like, cute. Now, genuinely, this doesn't look cheap. This does not look like it costed you 16 squid. I love it. It's so cute. Oh, I'm going to wear it with everything. The quality is really nice. I really like it. I'm buzzing about this. And to accessorize, I also got these earrings for that outfit. These are an oversized flat chain hoop. Can you see the chains? Chain, chain, getting paid over here. Thursday, baby, bring it over here. Shake your money maker, do your money maker. These are six pounds and the quality of these are so good. These are really bougie, so. And then I got some eyelashes. Oh. I got some eyelashes as well. These are TW19. They look like this. But they're just really cute for every day. They're really light and fluffy. They are quite long though, to be fair. 
but that doesn't mean you can't wear them every day. These were only three pounds as well, and I and I do really love Boohoo lashes. So here is the outfit in full. We've got the beautiful tie detail sleeve crop top with the ripped all over mum jeans, and then we've got the mini rucksack. With this outfit, I paired it with the boots that I got, but but you could wear this outfit with anything. Trainers, heels, sandals, it depends what look you're going for. I do like that like elegant, cute, feisty. I've got a bit of a mixture of styles. Okay, so let's move on to outfit number five. First, we have some tally jeans. So these have five pockets. They are distressed. They do have a few holes in them. Mostly two big holes over the knee. So you do see the knee. These ones are cropped, which is perfect for me. So they're gonna be such a nice length because if you are new here, I'm 5'2". So when they're slightly cropped, I'm just in heaven. These were 28 pounds and they're super stretchy skinny jeans. I got these in a size 22. These are something that I'd wear every single day with a nice t-shirt or a nice blouse or a jumper or a bodysuit. So with this, I would wear, this is such a tally everyday outfit. You guys have no idea. Like I live in outfits like this. So then we've got the black square neck ribbed bodysuit. We've already checked the poppers. They're good. They're fine. Well, actually I should just just check them again. Yeah, poppers are good. Super stretchy, this bodysuit. It's literally the same as the white one from the first outfit. So I got it in a size 22 and it's only 12 pounds, which is so good. So I have this with the jeans and then on top, you can literally stop there, by the way. You could just have that with like one of the cardigans I showed you earlier. And that's really cute with the black boots. Ooh, whole new outfit. That's outfit number six. But for this outfit, I got a leopard long sleeve mesh top. Now I got this in a size 24 so that it was slightly oversized. So it looked oversized that I can tuck in and wear on top of the black bodysuit. That way with the black bodysuit, you can still wear a normal bra if you have big boobs like me. This outfit really excites me. It's so cute. For a daytime, you could wear it with the black boots or for nighttime, wear it with heels and you're good to go. Such a saucy outfit. Love it. So to accessorize, I got a three pack skinny belt set. It comes with a black belt, a brown belt and then a white belt. It's 10 pounds and you can only get it in one size. I'm gonna check if that actually goes around me right now. Yeah, that fits really nicely actually. Love it when stuff comes in packs like that because now I've got three belts and it just adds something tiny to the outfit, especially when something's tucked in. Having a belt can just be really, really pretty. Because the belt is gold, I got some gold earrings to match. I got the triple hoop earrings. Can you see? It's just sort of focusing on my face. Triple hoop earrings. These were five pounds and they're just really cute. Like for every day, when you don't want anything heavy, these are really, really cute. So to finish off this outfit, I got a beautiful ring handle tote bag. This is so cute. It's really small, you can wear it like this, or you can just hold it like that. It's it's quite a decent size, that's it compared to my phone. So you can fit quite a lot in there. When you open it up, it's just got the tiniest zip there, and then it's got holes either side. So if your bag does tip over, then things will come out. That's kind of weird, look at that. For 20 pounds, it's not too bad at all. I wanted to show you an everyday handbag because the other bags have been small and if you want something a little bit bigger, it doesn't come with like a strap to put over your shoulder or to make it a crossbody. So you would literally have to hold it like this or like that. So this is outfit number five all together. We've got the black square neck rib bodysuit. We've got the triple hoop earrings. We've got the three pack skinny belt. And then with the ring handle tote bag and also the five pocket stretch 
jeans. So although these are an everyday jean and they do have a stretch to them, they're not actually the most comfortable. They are stretchy, but on the legs, they're not actually that stretchy. You know when they don't quite go up to your crotch and they're actually quite uncomfortable and you could easily chafe in them. And that's one of my pet peeves, to be honest. And actually the hole kind of comes up to my thigh and not my knee. Although I love the style, they're not the most comfortable jeans that I've got. Well, tally hoes, that's my five everyday outfits. What do you think? What's your favorite? What would you wear? I wanna know everything, so definitely comment down below. Personally, I wear boots with every single outfit, but I wanted to show you a little bit more variety. I do wear sandals quite often, and I'm trying to also wear more trainers and try and be more casual, you know? Thank you guys, honestly, so much for watching. I really, really hope that you enjoyed this video. This video shout out is to Lucy Hudson. Your comment was really, really cute and really made me smile, so thank you so much. If you guys wanna be shouted out in my next video, then all you have to do is comment down below and you may be picked. Thank you so much to Boohoo for sponsoring this video and I will see you very soon for my next video. I love you so much, bye.